Hi viewers, welcome to Universal. Thank you for watching. So today's topic is what blessings are coming towards you. It's a PK card reading. You need to choose one card, whichever you are drawn towards. If you want to watch multiple piles, you can watch. Mostly it is a blessing, so I don't think <laughs> there will be messages which is going to trigger you. Okay? I cannot assure, but anyway, it is a blessing, so you can watch multiple piles. So let's get into the reading. File number one, which is red pile. What blessings are coming towards you? So pile number one, the blessing is actually here. I don't know why it came into came like it is a blessing actually someone like queen of swords in the reverse is coming into your life they may be Libra or Aquarius person who are very manipulative or I can say that they they use their their abuse you are Their words can hurt you. They are very sharp tongued person, but here the thing is, it is in the reverse. So they may be going to hurt you in some way. The thing here is, if at all you have any kind of wounds within you, this person is going to surface. Those wounds will come to the surface because of this person. I really not understanding why it came in the blessing card because it is completely having this kind of person is like very difficult to handle them because they manipulate and they use they as I said they are very abusive uh, they use their words very harshly which can hurt you They are not soft spoken person. Maybe after coming this person after coming into your life they are going to i think here they are going to help you to heal yourself but the thing is they are doing it in the wrong way or i can say that only this is a way to heal you it is completely depend on your situation because healing is a process which is done in a different ways but here this person is they are going to hurt you but with that hurt you are going to heal yourself or I don't know it is like here actually this person is going to manipulate you they can they will use abusive words or with words they will control you but the thing is because of that manipulation because of that hurtful words you are going to learn something or you are going to heal something which you never thought it is going to heal maybe there are some wounds within you you never dare to touch that or you never thought to heal or you, you decided to live with those wounds I can say. But this person actually the way they are behaving is wrong way. But I think in your case that is the right way to do the things maybe. That is, a, that is the reason why they came in the reading of blessing. This person 
when you are approaching or this person is approaching you or you are approaching this person when you are dealing with this person it may not look like very friendly or soft you won't feel comfortable i can say because this kind of people are not comfortable they won't make people comfortable it is like one way also one some other way if you are the person who are very much habituated for comfort zone this person will bring you out of your comfort zone because the way they behave you don't have any other choice to come out of your comfort zone <laughs> other than that they won't give you any choice so in one way it is a good thing actually coming out of your comfort zone doing something or whichever the wounds you may be having within inside which you thought to live with them but it is not good for you because you won't move forward in your life this person will help you to clear all those things but the thing is the way is very as i said it will it will hurt you no obviously when we are coming out of our comfort zone it will hurt us because comfort zone is like everything is fine we no need to take any kind of pain here this person will make you to take that pain and come out of your comfort zone one way this person will help you to lead a new life i can say if at all you are the person currently in a situation where you are feeling like you are in a comfort zone and you don't want to come out of it you are very much happy in that comfort zone and you like the the way you are living or the lifestyle you are having you are very much okay with your comfort zone but the blessing is this person is coming into your life this person will change your whole life completely in the 360 degree cycle say because the way they approach as i said the day, the way they deal with you is very harsh because this person don't give it is like they don't show sympathy or empathy you should not expect such kind of thing they are very honest and brutal in some way and here i think here they will become more harsh towards you to come out of your comfort zone so anyway they are going to change your life after coming this person into your life your life is going to completely change in a better way i can say maybe they will help you to cut some people in your life you are going to lose some people here i don't want to say help because it is completely a card which is like one person is holding a sword in their hand and telling you to do all the things so i cannot say it is a help so i don't want to say it in anyway. i'm not even getting that word so it is like they will control you completely first thing and with that control maybe you are the person who some people will be there even i have some people around me if i say them with a soft voice in a calm loving way they won't listen if i say them in a harsh way they will listen they immediately do that wrong so some people will be habituated like that so here i think you may be earth sign people because i have earth sign people they are very much stubborn people they won't listen when we say with loving and caring they want some harshness or harsh words or command and demand and type then they will do it it is like warning it is like completely warning you are doing it or not if you are not doing you are not going to get this whatever it is like a completely warning so here this person is controlling you this person is going to control you like that but it is for your good not for bad they may be the way they are doing as i said healing is like there are some people we need to handle them with care love that compassion kindness we need to handle them in that way but there are very rare people they don't understand this kindness it is not that they won't understand but the thing is when you say when you tell them with loving caring way they won't listen and they will think that it's okay we will do it tomorrow that kind of people if at all they are lazy and they are very much okay with comfort zone zone people they don't listen they if we are telling very 
softly they will think it's okay we will do it tomorrow from tomorrow onwards we will do it but here that is also maybe one reason why this person won't show that softness to you they will behave very harshly as i said they will give you warnings every everything is under their control they will give you warnings you need to do that if they said that you need to do this you need to do that and here this power, this person holds that power to make you to do that that is the reason why they came into the blessing card but this person whatever they are doing it is for your better your your life will become better this person act in your life as a teacher i can say or one kind of guide i can say but they are like strict teacher strict person you cannot expect softness from them they may be very soft person but here in your case they are not using it i can say that they are not using their heart they won't they are not going to use their heart they are going to use their logical brain more than their heart so that is also one reason why they are going to control you in a very different way where which is going to help you to become a better person in your life if at all you are not doing anything in your life you don't want to change your life this person will make you to change but the way they are doing is the see as per my knowledge it is a wrong way but as i said some people don't listen when we say in a loving way so for them it is very important for them to become very strict then only they will listen so maybe here also same situation maybe you are the person who will listen only by warnings if they give warnings if at all you are doing it or not if you don't do you are not going to get this then you are going to do that because you want so and so thing so maybe it depends on your nature your character if it is resonating take it because here i am sensing this person is not going to handle you soft way they may be very soft spoken person maybe they are very caring but here the way they are acting with you is very different but whatever they are doing it is for your good your highest good that you should understand that's why it came into you came in blessings it is like some relationships will be there whatever they will give the tests or whatever situations they will put you in that situation will make you to learn something to become a better version of yourself to become wise so maybe this person after coming into your life they are going to put you in lot of situations where you are going to learn lot of things that's why i said in the in the starting you are going to come out of your comfort zone because if at all you are staying in same comfort zone you are not going to get anything there is no up and downs in life okay because everything is comfortable but here after coming this person nothing is comfortable okay if at all you are living in comfort zone enjoy it because very soon this person is going to come into your life <laughs> you need to come out of your comfort zone so just be prepared for that it is a blessing actually don't think that that person is a very bad person or they are not behaving well with you actually they are doing it good for you okay it is for your good let's move on to pile number 2 who chose hello pile hello pile what blessings are coming towards you so pile number 2 the blessing is you are going to leave all your worries stress responsibilities in one way if it all you are feeling any kind of responsibilities any kind of controlling in your life you are completely becoming very free from everything in your life it is like your life is starting or your life is going to take a new beginning it is completely unknown adventurous journey where you find everything new there is no 
nothing left from the past i can see here you may be it is see it is a first card in the tarot that means new beginning no matter what you are dealing currently in your life everything is going to wipe it will become universe is wiping everything from your past and it is making your life as a clean slate where you can start writing whatever you want to write there is no past is left in that slate completely clean slate like a kind of life you are going to get so whatever you want to write it is completely depends on you the full card is like that's what it is completely clean slate what you are going to whatever you want to write you can write it is completely depends on you and whatever you are going to do it is like an adventure because everything is new whatever roads you are going to take that roads also it's a new new roads it is not always most taken roads it is like not travel till now you are not travel till now it is completely new life if at all it is regarding to your career matters also you are going to enter in no matter what you are doing currently what kind of career you are pursuing but blessing is like you are entering in this position where you will get a chance to start everything new there is no past or no old things are left in that so i think here in the career also you are going to get or you are going to enter in a new career which you never till now at least till now you never worked in that industry or in that area completely different career whatever you are doing right now whatever career you are into you are entering into a new career if at all you are in the relationships also till now whomever you meet maybe you always meet the same people same kind of people because as a human psychology we always attracted towards same kind of people but here you are going to meet completely different people in your life till now you never met such kind of people even as i said even if you want if you are going to date if you are coming into relationships also that people won't be like your old people in the past people they are completely different from the past people character wise personality wise everything it is completely different so here i can say that you are not going you fit all i don't i'm not sensing that you are attached because if you are attached you won't come into this energy but you are coming into this full energy means you master the detachment simply once you master the detachment then only you will come into this energy now it is your life it is new life for you whatever you want to do with that new life you can create it so here you are reaching in this position the blessing is coming into this energy if at all you are still now the time the moment when you are watching this reading still if, we, if at all you have any kind of past issues past wounds or past uh, some kind of memories very soon everything is going to wipe from your brain you are going to let go of everything completely you are not going to have any kind of strings attached to your past it is completely new life and that new life also very happy like with you are going to enjoy that new life like chain like energy it is completely different new things so as human beings when we see the new things how we enjoy we will enjoy a lot so i here I, what i want to tell you is here you are not going to feel uncomfortable that is the reason why i said you may be mastered in detachment because when you have some attachments from your past you are you won't be in this energy the fool is very much happy with the new things they won't be having any kind of uncomfortability even though they don't know where they are going where they are going to end up but still they feel very happy and the adventurous kind of nature will be there so the, there is no strings attached from your past i can say here everything is 
if at all you have any kind of karmic cycles as i said any past memories past relationships everything is going to end in your life the life is going to start from zero so it is a very good thing actually so pile number 2 whoever chooses pile number 2 no matter what is happening currently in your life no need to worry very soon universe is going to bless you with this energy where you can start your life in a new way and you are going to enjoy it one more time you are going to live your life it is like a second chance second chance for your life enjoy it everyone won't get that second chance so let's move on to pile number 3 which is blue pile so blue pile what blessings are coming towards you so pile number 3 there is a person who is like page of wands is going to come into your life they may be aries or leo or sagi or their their chart is very much affected by dominated by fire sign this person is very passionate fiery and very chatty also so why they came as a blessing is actually this person have a lot of talent or ideas because this person is a page they are very mature they are like a kid they no matter what age they are they may be 50 60 40 no matter what age but their brain is like a kid kids brain children's hmm, child brain so they think creatively this person is very creative very passionate very fiery towards to do the things to generate the ideas he have some courage also but the thing is this person lacks that confidence within themselves to achieve all those things or when they have idea they will, they will be having so many ideas because they are very creative person so they think creatively so they will generate a lot of ideas but they lack the confidence to implement those ideas that is the problem with this person this kid i don't want to say person because they are like a kid okay so this kid can be very creative they will give lot of new ideas their thoughts or their ideas or their brain will act very fastly they are intelligent also that is also one reason why you see if at all someone is facing some problems in their life this person this kid can have the ability to suggest a different solution which is creative solution till now no one suggested that solution or no one thought about such kind of solution for that problem for that particular problem but this kid can do that but the thing is here people don't believe on them or don't believe in their words as i said they are a kid first thing so obviously no matter how talented the kid is we still treat them as a kid second they even law don't have that kind of self confidence so because of that lack of self confidence even this kid also don't want to try all those ideas to or um, they don't want to implement those ideas those creative ideas because this kid lack that confidence level so this kind of person is coming into your life so here if at all you are a very mature person who can help this kid to become something it is not just helping them they can help you also because you can use their talent you can use their creativity you can use their passionate uh, that passionate nature to do to do something so here 
this kid, kid is coming and like a blessing in your life means you if, as i said if you are a mature person and if you are dealing with any business or working work area so this kid will help you to create something new because as i said they have all the things but they don't have that confidence to execute the things so if you are the person who have confidence to execute the things then you both can do wonders i can say you both can create very great things because this kid need that moral support that support where someone can believe in their ideas and where someone can support them to execute those ideas that kid is lack of that self confidence so you are the person who can give them support and that confident and that moral that moral support if you help them to implement those ideas by believing them by trusting them you both are going to create something big i can say here so here completely he, he, this came into the blessing means definitely this person or kid is going to help you more than one way they will they are going to help you more than one way but it is like you need to trust them you need to trust them and you need to have that confidence on them because that is the problem what they have they don't trust themselves and they lack that self confidence and as i said they are mind with child mentality so because of that people don't trust them so pile number 3 whoever choose blue pile if someone is entering in your life like a creative mindset with lot of passion to do something they may be sound act like a kid but give them a chance they are going to create something wonderful they just need support and that to trust them okay if you trust them if you give that support they are going to create some wonders so it will help you professionally or personally the way you are going to use their ideas if at all you are a business person you can hire this person because this person can create lot of things they will help you to grow your business i can say not just in a business actually this person can do some wonders the thing is they don't have that self confidence they need to if fit on you give that moral support and if you trust them you both can do wonders so let's move on to pile number 4 who choose white pile so pile number 4 what blessings are coming towards you So, pile number four. The blessing is King of Hands is coming towards you. This person is like a natural leader. At least, if they are not leader, they have some qualities to become a leader. They have that qualities because it is a Aries. They are like a boss, bossy, bossy Aries people. The chart may be dominated by Leo also, Leo and Aries. fire signs they are very fiery this king is very fiery passionate and very courageous that's why they have that ability to become leader their solar plexus chakra is very active no matter what happens they never lose their self confidence their solar plexus is always active even though they fail they still be in the positive energy they don't get into that negative energy or negative thoughts because their self confidence is very high it is not like over confidence but they have good self confidence i can say balance of self confidence this person is going to bring some passion into your life if at all your life is currently not passionate 
if at all you are feeling bored this person is going to help you to make it little bit passionate not little bit i think they can make passionate this person have a lot of experience in their life they may be little bit older than you because this king is very mature king they may be older than you so they have much experience than you i can say at least in the 3d level experience in the logical level handling people how in the work area in the professional matters in the business they have they are very experienced person i think here you have some problem with if at all you have problem with your career where you are feeling there are things like if at all you are you don't have confidence on yourself or you are not believing in yourself and you are not moving forward in your career or at least you are not having any career that's what i say it is like you are not feeling passionate towards your life this person is going to help you to come out of that this person will help you to get that confident level back in your life or in one way i can say that this person is going to help you to heal your solar plexus because here i am strongly seeing this yellow color so this person make you to believe in yourself if at all you are feeling any kind of self confidence low self esteem issues or not courageous if you want to do something but you don't have any courage to do this person is going to help you to do all those things this person help you to become passionate towards your life become courageous become having that self confidence that's why i said they are completely help you to heal your solar plexus chakras your third chakra i i think you already know this person because this person is feeling some kind of regret or some kind of guilt they have some guilt feeling or regret kind of thing or some kind of pain in this in their face so maybe if you know this person if at all something happened in the past now because of that guilt feeling or that regrets whatever they did in the past because it is completely regret regret and guilt that pain is there within them so they are feeling regret towards what happened in the past so now because of that they want to help you to heal your solar plexus chakra either this person is the one who who is the reason why you lost all these things or you may be lost all those things no matter whatever the reason but this person is going to help you to come out of all those things because it is like i think you are the person who lost all those things this self confidence this solar plexus is completely not there and you are not courageous you are not passionate this person is going to bring all those things back in your life this is a blessing you are going to get if at all i don't think maybe the this person is not done all those things maybe some reasons you lost all those things because of your situations or problems they, that is why they came into blessing but still they have some regrets or some guilt now it is completely depends on the situation Uh, or the relation what you are sharing as i said this person is elder than you because this person is very mature person 
very little bit like aged person not like young person so anyway they are going to help you to become more confident more courageous more passionate towards your life so pile number 4 if at all currently you are not doing anything in your life you are feeling that you lost everything in your life this person is coming into your life very soon they are very strong aries very bossy and this person is going to help you especially here i am sensing professionally they are going to help you professional matters career related matters because here i am not sensing any love and those things it is completely making you confident and courageous passionate one more time in your life because i think currently you are you don't have such that things you are missing those things so universe is sending this person in your life as a blessing to recover all those things they will help you to get back into your feet so let's move on to pile number 5 which is green pile so pile number 5 what blessings are coming to us you So, pile number five, your ships are finally reaching to the destination. <laughs> I think yesterday or the before yesterday, we got this card. Someone is waiting for their ships to reach their destination. So the blessing is finally you are going to receive your gift or blessing, whatever blessing you are waiting for. Because as I said. this three of wands is like one person is patiently waiting for their time i can say or their abundance or their success or their result or that that materialistic gains any kind of you are going to finally receiving your success for your hard work you are, you are doing you did not doing you did lot of hard work and you are patiently waiting for the result and the blessing is finally you are receiving your success finally you are receiving outcome of that hard work this ships which you are waiting from very long finally they are reaching they are reaching their destination this person is really very long they are waiting i think some aries person is watching this reading because today i got lot of aries energy So, pile number five. I don't think here I have so many things to tell because after that, it is simply I don't want to extend the reading because it will become very complicated. very lengthy so anyway pile number 5 who your choose green pile whatever you are waiting for it is coming towards you it is finally reaching not just coming you are finally going to have it in your life i know here three of wands is like waiting for something from very long and whatever needs to be done you already did it and finally you are getting the result which is success or i can say which is positive which is completely belong to you because you are the only one who is the owner of this ships so they need to come towards you only so maybe because of some reasons it took time to come towards you but finally the blessing is you are going to receive this ships 
or you are going to receive whatever you are desiring for or you are waiting for not just desiring it is like it is waiting patiently you are waiting for that thing person thing job whatever it may be take as it resonates if at all you are waiting for some job from very long it is going to come you are going to receive that job if you are waiting for some person from very long you are going to get that person in your life that is a blessing okay so if at all in the past they may be having you may be having some obstacles problems because of that it took longer than what you expected because it is waiting card three of wands is like a waiting card so you waited more than what you should wait i can say here so here finally you are going to get that blessings you are go, you are going to receive your blessings which is completely belongs to you so thank you for watching for more readings you can like and subscribe for personal readings you can mail me you'll find the details in description box